if you think about King's Cross area, it's uh, filled with uh, quite big contrast. Campbell Street Natural Park is so tiny and it's squeezed by the urban setting around it. So on the background you can see these new developments rising. Uh, this delicate relationship between built and unbuilt and man and nature, which is so strongly present here at King's Cross, uh, is something that we wanted to reflect in our design. In Finland you have these thousands of islands because it's the land of thousand lakes. And in these uh, lakes you have these rocky islets that are like uh, natural landmarks. So we wanted to have something similar here that would uh, attract new visitors for the park but would also blend into its surroundings. The final form of the pavilion is uh, intentionally reminding of a Finnish uh, shelter so where you can hide behind the roof and observe the nature. Wood has traditionally been used in Finland for a very long time and it's uh, really an essential part of our culture because in Finland we have so much forest so the natural choice for building material was wood. Our starting point for building the viewpoint was to disturb the delicate ecosystem and park which is so rich in biodiversity as little as possible. It was transported uh, to London and assembled and uh, lifted down to the canal and towed in place during just one day. Back at home in Helsinki we actually managed to find a webcam shooting Granary Square, so we saw the actual lifting, but then it went outside the picture, which was really nerve-wracking. In this project, they wanted Finnish architects to design something here, because um, maybe we can offer something new and some new perspectives. Finnish and Scandinavian design uh, is more, maybe more humble and more minimalistic. If the project was designed by um, a British people, I think the design would be a bit different, it would be a bit bigger, probably.